Good morning. Now, one of those deceased victims is a 28 year old woman that she was shot and killed in Garfield Park while sitting in a vehicle. Take a look at this video that we have here. It happened around 1130 last night on the 200 block of North Pulaski. The victim was sitting in a car with another person. The police say someone walked up to the vehicle and fired off rounds. 28 year old woman was shot in the back. A 26 year old man was also hit inside that vehicle. Now, both were taken to Stroger Hospital where the woman was pronounced deceased. The man is in critical condition. Also yesterday, a 35 year old man was shot in the head around 4 p.m. Now this shooting took place on the 6100 block of South Troop Street. Police say a group of people were sitting on a porch when two people got out of a vehicle and fired shots in their direction, hitting four of them. Witnesses said they were not the targets. They were just caught in the crossfire. He wasn't into anything. He was just going across the walk across the street to get a pop from his uncle. And he just got caught in a, in a, in a crossfire. Yes, innocent. And again, 53 people were shot over the weekend. 13 have since died, including three that were killed after midnight today. Now, we are hearing that the superintendent will speak about the violence that took place over the weekend. It's going to happen at 10 a.m. at McCormick Place. Of course, we'll be there to bring you the latest details on that. But for now, we're live outside of police headquarters. I'm Glenn Marshall, WGN News.